Good morning everyone. Welcome to the morning meditation. Together, let's begin our day by bowing down to Mother, raising our Kundalini and taking a Pandhan. Jai Mataji. Before we begin, let's take a minute to settle our attention. We can either look at Mother's photograph or keep both our hands towards Mother Earth and just relax our shoulders, relax our mind and within our heart let us just pray to mother to guide us throughout the meditation throughout the day and be there with us in every action in every task of the day shamata ji Mother, please guide us throughout the meditation. Please be by our side throughout the day. surrender 
our actions our thoughts our emotions to you mother Together, let us sing the three great mantras. After yesterday's beautiful meditation on attention, today we'll be focusing on our muladhara and heart. Yesterday, throughout the day, after a couple of low days. Like how life and how Shri Mataji keeps giving us lessons and you know keep giving us, we keep learning things. Throughout the day, I was very strict with myself, not to rush, and just in every action, in every thought that was troubling, pray to Mother and surrender that thought to Mother. And everything worked out so beautifully. So just like that today, focusing our attention on our muladhara, on our heart and sahasrara, we'll try to surrender our actions, our thoughts to Mother, and pray to Shri Mataji 
to give us that state of balance throughout the day. So keeping our attention on the Muladhara, let us sing one mantra to Shri Ganesha. Om Dvameva Sakshat Shri Ganesha Sakshat Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devi Namo Namaha Shri Mataji Please manifest within us the beautiful qualities of Shri Ganesha. Please manifest within us the qualities of innocence, purity, wisdom, and discretion. Mother, please make us worthy of you. Shri Ganesha, please remove all the obstacles in our spiritual ascent. Keeping our right hand on our heart, just keeping our attention on our left heart. Let us pray to Mother. Shri Mataji, please come in my heart. Mother, take away all the negativities. Take away all the impure desires, the jealousy, and please fill our hearts with love, kindness, And pure attention. Let us sing one mantra to Sri Shiva Parvati. Shri Shiva Parvati Saksha Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devi Namo Namaha In our hearts, 
Let us say with complete love and confidence. Mother, I am the spirit. I am not this body, not this mind, not these thoughts. I am the pure spirit. Keeping our attention on the right heart or we can bring our right hand back to our lap and keeping our left hand on our right heart, whatever suits best, whatever is comfortable. Again with all the love let's pray to Mother, Shri Mataji. You are the responsibility in me. Mother, please manifest within us the righteous behavior. Shri you are the responsibility in me. You take care of all the actions, of all the responsibilities. Mother, you do everything. Mother, you manage everything. I do nothing. Let us sing one mantra to Sri Sita Rama. Om Dvameva Saksha Shri Sita Rama Saksha Shri Abhishakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devi Namo Namaha Slowly, whenever you feel ready, bringing our left hand back on our lap. Now, let us keep our attention on our center heart. Here, let us sing one mantra to Sri Durga Mata Jagatamba. Om Tvameva Saksha Sri Durga Mata Jagatamba Saksha Sri Adi Shakti Mata Ji Shri Nirmala Devi Namo Namaha Mother, you are the sense of security within me. Shri Mataji, 
please take away all the fears within me and please bless us with complete motherly protection mother let there be no place for fear in our hearts slowly raising a few strands of kundalini to the top of our head keeping our attention on the sahasrara it is played pray to mother shimata ji i surrender all my thoughts to you mother i surrender all my thoughts all the emotions to you please establish my self realization mother please establish my self realization Together, let us listen to Mother's talk. It's an excerpt. Uh, it's two excerpts uh, on the importance of meditation. yourself at all the kundalini itself directs there are so many different forms of meditation just 
this can be so to meditation as well? No, no, it does not. We do not meditate. We have to be in meditation. There's difference between the two. You do not meditate before realization. After realization, you are in meditation. So you become thoughtlessly aware. So when you meditate in Sahaja Yoga, you become thoughtlessly aware and then you start going into a new awareness or a higher awareness which you call as doubtless awareness. And that is how you start going. So the meditation is that you get into meditation. You don't do meditation. And it's such a spontaneous happening. Only thing you have to learn to be spontaneous. And that's what we, I find that in search people still, though they are out of uh, this illusion, this ocean of illusion, still sometimes their one leg is still there in the ocean and still they are putting it out and pushing it back. That should not be. That is only because people don't meditate. Now to say you must meditate, people think it's a kind of a ritual or maybe a kind of a style of search. No. Meditation is for you to go deep down into yourself, to achieve all that your sastra wants to give, to achieve that height of detachment, of understanding, is only through meditation. So what happens in meditation is that your awareness crosses over agya, goes above and is now stationed in the sastrara, in thoughtless awareness. Then the reality of sastrara, the beauty of sastrara starts pouring in your own character, in your own temperament. Unless and until you meditate, not meditate just to get well or just to feel that I must meditate. But meditation is very important for all of you that you develop your sastrara in such a manner that you imbibe the beauty of your sastrara. If you don't use your sastrara in this way, after some time you will find sastrara will close down, you will have no vibrations and you will have no understanding of yourself. So very, very important thing is to meditate. I can immediately better make out a person who has been meditating and the one who has not been making, uh, has not been meditating. Because a person who does not meditate is still thinks that, oh, it's all right, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. Meditation is the only way you can enrich yourself with the beauty of reality. There's no other way. I cannot find any other way but meditation by which you rise into the realm of divinity. For example, I would say that myself, whatever I've done is this, that I've been able to find out a method how to give self-realization to masses. But that doesn't mean that if I give to masses, they are all such of this, no? You must have seen whenever you have your programs, people get realization when I'm there <coughs> and they um, come to programs for a while and then they drop off. The reason is they have not meditated. They, If they had meditated, they would have known what is their quality, what are they. Without meditation, you don't understand what is best for you. So today is a day when you have to promise me that you will meditate every night, every evening, maybe in the morning also. Whenever it is possible, if you can go into meditative mood, you are in contact with this divine power. Then whatever is good for you, whatever good for your society, for your country, all is done by this divine power. You don't have to overpower the divine power. 
You don't have to order, you don't have to ask. Just if you meditate, you are one with this all-pervading power, which is another great blessings to us. I am not saying that you go on meditating for hours together, not necessary. But with full faith in yourself and in the divine power, if you work it out, I am sure it's not difficult to rise to that state of consciousness. That is what we have to achieve. It's possible for men as well as for women. The inner side of yourself, the subtler side of your being, you must allow the Kundalini to go through the Agra. To cross the Agra is a very important thing in modern times. And for that you have to meditate. If you can meditate with complete faith in yourself, this Agra can be opened up with surrendering to the Divine. You have to surrender yourself to the Divine. And when this Agya opens, you'll be amazed your Sastra is just waiting to transfer, to give you all the help that you need through the all-pervading form. Your connection of Sastra with the all-pervading power is established. And by that, you'll be amazed how all these seven chakras work for How they help, how they try to give you whatever is the real knowledge about it. But first and foremost is your sastra. Only your sastra can reflect the light of the divine. So your sastra is extremely important. You must meditate to enrich your sastra, to cure it, to make it completely nourished by the Kundalini. There's no need to do many rituals, but meditation and also a little bit of taking Bandhan even now today is necessary, I think, uh, <coughs> when you go out. Because still uh, Kali Yuga is working its own banks and the Satya Yuga is trying to come. We are the ones who are going to support, look after, and that's why the sastra uh, opening is very, very important. It's very important. And those who want to grow should meditate every day, whatever time you may come home, maybe in the morning, maybe in the evening, any time. But you will know that you are meditating when you can get into thoughtless awareness. Then you will know. Your reaction will be zero. Look at something, you just look at it. You won't react because you are thoughtless. You won't react. When that reaction is not there, then everything will be surprised, is divine. Because reaction is your agas problem. Once you are absolutely thoughtlessly aware, you are one with the divine. So much so, that divine takes over every activity, every moment of your life and looks after you. And you feel completely secure, one with the divine, and enjoy the blessings of the divine. May God bless you. Let's complete our meditation by taking the third of the three great mantras.
मोक्षाप्रदायिनी माता जी श्री निर्मला देवी नमो नमः थैंक यू मदर थैंक यू फॉर एवरीथिंग Thank you everyone for joining. Wishing you all a beautiful day ahead. I'll leave the music on for some time and we can all bow down, raise our kundalini and take a bandhan.
Thank you everyone. Jai Shri Mataji.